Welcome everybody to another Grotopia video. My name is Shadow Surfer, and today it's everybody's favorite update of the year, Player Appreciation Week. It's eight. Wait, is it eight days? Wait, it's seven days, right? Yeah, that's a week. Seven days of absolute insanity because every single day there's new content being pushed out. There's new commands. There's new items. There's new clothes. It is absolutely amazing. And if you ask anybody, I guarantee the majority of the people would say. That player appreciation week or PAW paw for uh, for short. Uh, I, I guarantee most everybody will say this is their absolute favorite update. And apparently they added a riding turtle into the game, which I, I'm gonna try to get. I don't know how much it costs, but I'm willing to put down whatever amount of world locks or do whatever it takes to actually get the item. But in this video, we're just gonna go through, look at all the items, look at all the new things that were added into the game, and uh, it's gonna be a good time. Let's get into it. Let's go. Oh my gosh. All right, right after I recorded this intro, this guy, I asked him if he knew anybody who had the riding turtle for sale. And he said one of his friends had it. So I don't know if we're going to get it right off the bat, but that would be absolutely insane. Okay, so apparently he's going to go try and find his friend. Hopefully we'll try and find it somewhere else, but uh, we'll see what happens. All right, so if I take a look at Slash News here, you see that I'm a little late to the party. It's already day six. Um, I want to have a video out for day seven as well for uh, Super Mod Dance Party. And then this one's just going to be a recap of... Kind of just going through the new stuff. So, day one, apparently there's burning hands, which I don't even know how you get that. Can of beans, orange juice, oranges, amethyst block. Oh, and there's a new visual to the to the vending machine. So yeah, yeah, this is this is what the new vending machine looks like if it's empty. I guess that's really useful for, for, for like vending world owners to see if their stuff is sold. Oh, wait, but there's that new command. What is it, like shrug? No, it's not shrug slash, uh, oh, fold arms. <laughs> yeah, okay, that looks weird with the surfboard. It's like I'm hugging the surfboard. <laughs> so day two, there's like some shoes. I don't know what, I don't know what those look like, but they look pretty cool. And then like a wedding something. And then a sir, sarong, sarong, I don't know how to say that. <laughs> Uh, and then there's some I mean that's day two was mostly just clothes. It looks like oh and apparently okay So you could do stubborn and it does it or you could do slash f a or slash fold and It does the same command so day three There's this they added this anti-gravity generator. That's nuts. We're gonna look at that. Wait, when was the mini mod added hold on that was like in the early days right like day two or three so yeah there's this mini mod you can buy it for 20 grow tokens i'm not doing that because i think i only have like 60 or 70 grow tokens um so basically if you punch him and he's in your world it doesn't allow anybody to drop items in the world which i'm not like i don't understand the usefulness of that but i guess I guess if people want to make a, a shop world or something like that, they can do that. But I, I love the name of it. It's it's amazing. And then, so, for day three... Okay, so also in day three, there's these wind sprites, and then there's inside-out devil wings. I have seen them. They look really cool, but they're not my style. And then day four... They added this lock, which we're going to look at. It locks 200 tiles, and you can either choose to make it uh, have build only or break only. And then so day five was all about like double everything. So you get two grow tokens from $10 in-app purchase, one grow token from five. Um, the no ignore list is doubled. The friends list is doubled to 400 people, which is nuts. There's new daily bonuses, and uh, Steam travels two times faster, new life goals, and then you get two grow tokens earned from com completing all the daily bonuses. And then so day six, which I'm extremely excited about, um, there's the new slash FC command, which it sends out a broadcast to just your friends. And apparently there's new sharks and there's the riding turtle, which is what my goal is for this video to get. If I get that, I'm going to be so hyped. Wait, as we speak, one of my friends just said they found a seller. No no way 
Oh my gosh, it looks so sick. Okay, so this is gonna be a, a hit to the bank right here. Oh, it looks so cool though. I don't even care. No, no regrets. No regrets at all. Riding turtle acquired. Let's go. I can't believe we got it this early. I bought it for 450, which I know is overpaying. But look at that. Oh my gosh. No way. Oh my. Wait, does it have the speedy mod? I can't tell. It doesn't? Oh no. Whatever. It's still the coolest thing ever. Riding turtle info. It's not the fastest transportation around, but it is the bumpiest. Yeah, I guess that makes sense because turtles aren't aren't uh meant to be fast. Oh my gosh. I can't believe it. Look at the animation of it run. This is the most amazing thing I've ever seen in this game. Believe it. And then Oh my, we have three pets. We have three pets in the family. Let's go. <laughs> no way he bought me one. I don't want it. Take it and give it away for 50k subs. Okay, well, should I give it away? I guess. <laughs> so if you guys didn't see the last video or my last um getting a dream item video it has a nuts amount of views basically uh he gave me a surfboard which it is still in my inventory and i literally wear it all the time because it's my favorite item ever and this is like when this was announced this riding turtle i was like there's no way i cannot get this so basically he bought it for me and about two, two minutes after I bought mine, he messaged me and he's like, dude, I got you a riding turtle. And so he has this one and he doesn't know what to do with it. So I guess he's giving it to me, which is pretty cool. Okay, guys, so we got two of these. We have two riding turtles now. Um, yeah, so I'll announce at the end of this video what I'm gonna be, how I'm gonna be giving it away and what I'm gonna do with it. So stay tuned for that. All right, let's check out the things in the store now. So builder's lock and anti-gravity gen generator. Let's actually buy this with gems. Okay, well rip my gems. Okay, so builder's lock, bang. Okay, so it looks the size of a huge lock. Oh, okay, new options. This lock allows building or breaking only if allow anyone to build or break is checked above. Okay, so I you check that and then someone just broadcasted my name and now I'm getting spammed. Oh my. So if you if you check that, only people can't even break this, but they can build in it. Oh, okay. So I guess you can even limit your admins. Okay. Yeah, that that lock is uh I think it's good for break worlds especially. All right. And then this this is the thing I really wanted to look at, this anti-gravity generator. So it basically makes it so Dude, I am getting spammed right now. How do people find... Okay, so this this basically makes it so you can literally fly. And people, people are saying it's like you're a mod and you're flying, um, but we're gonna have to take a look at it because I haven't even really seen it that much. But you see, it's 450,000 gems. Is that the most expensive item in the store? I don't think there's anything even close to that. There's nothing remotely close to that. And I don't know how much it costs, but we're gonna we're gonna try and buy one. Alright, 260 world locks. Well, we just spent some money this episode. Okay. So that's that's how high you can jump. Alright. What? Turn on! Hello? Okay. That was weird. So I guess you can jump infinitely. Yeah, this is, uh, this is almost like mod flying, but it's not at the same time. This feels a lot floatier. I guess, uh, yeah, I mean, that makes sense because it's anti-gravity. You can literally jump infinitely. I don't know. I, like, I posted on my Instagram. I feel like this could change the game for world building. Um, I think there, there can be some really cool worlds coming out soon. And I really want to get into that if I have time. Um, let me know if you want to see, like, episodes of me building an anti-grav world because I think that'd be interesting. I haven't really built a world in forever. This just seems really cool and uh, I think I can do some really cool things with it. Yeah, I, I, I want to check out um, worlds now that have it. Is it Horn? Yeah, this is it. So there's this Howler. He has three Howlers down at the end. Yeah, so these Howler things, they kill you if you go over it and so you can just jump infinitely through them um, and I'm gonna see if I can get past it in one go. Here we go. I need to zoom out. Okay, okay, that was come on. 
Okay, I need to get my jumps timed better. God! Okay, I have to try it one more time. What was that? They're like next to each other! Alright, yeah, we're done with this. Alright, I'm gonna go in here. And then... Okay, yep. There they all are. It's so loud! I can't hear myself think! Oh my... There's so many people here. It's insane. Okay, well, we have max people here, so that's fun. <laughs> All I wanted was to show off my turtle, but there's so many people. Wait, hold on. What happens if I... What happens if I use the surfboard? Oh, it just gets rid of the turtle. <laughs> that's weird. I like that, though. Okay, yeah, I think that's it. That about does it for the video. There, there's a lot more items in it, but I don't really feel like going through all the clothes and whatnot because, I mean, a lot of them are really hard to find. Plus, like, I only get- I went through the most exciting things like the anti-gravity generator, the new lock, and this new turtle, which is incredible. Um, I'm actually so happy I got that. So, this is day six- well, this was day one through six that I showed. Tomorrow is the hype day for mods. Um, a lot of people like it, a lot of people dislike it. I like it because I get to chill with all you guys. Um, Super Mod Dance Party would basically just go to a world and dance in the middle, and it's pretty fun just to mess around with people. It's just a day to kind of kind of chill and relax with all the players and give back to the community almost. So yeah, I'm hoping to have a video out on that. Yeah, and regarding the giveaway um, for this Riding Turtle, I'm actually going to give away the um, Builder's Luck as well. So all you got to do is put a comment down below. You don't have to subscribe or like or all that like everybody else says. Um, but if you if you enjoy my content, then uh, that, that is very much appreciated. So put a comment down below. All you have to do is put a world name and tell me why you want this item. Um, I'm gonna choose two comments at random. I'll give one person the riding turtle and then one person the builder's lock. So if you want one of those, make sure to comment. Yeah, that's that's about it. I'm almost at 50k, which is nuts. Um, thank you for that. I mean, player appreciation week is by far my favorite update. Let me know if it's your favorite because it, it's, it's so fun to see a new update every single day. So thank you for everybody who gave me support on my last video. If you haven't seen it, it'll be down below in the description. Thank you for watching. This is Shadow Surfer, signing out. See ya.